Someone asked a question about significance of Salat. And I just want to say this, my brothers and sisters, don't just be satisfied with just making your Salat and, you know, um, but try when you make your prayer to feel something for Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Try not to be thinking about other things. And I just want to mention this one hadith. Uh, and the Prophet Muhammad wasalam, was very observant. And he was watching a person, he was sitting in the masjid with some sahaba. And a Muslim came in and made salat and came to the Prophet and said, Assalamu alaikum. The Prophet said, Wa alaikum salam, farajit fa salli, fa inna kalam tu salli. Go back and pray because you have not prayed. You see, the Prophet is very observant. So he's watching the man, so the man went back and prayed again. And when he finished, he came to the Prophet and said, Assalamu alaikum, ya Rasulullah. The Prophet said, Wa alaikum salam, farajit fa salli, fa inna kalam tu salli. Go back and pray for you have not prayed. This happened three times. And the man said, O Messenger of Allah, teach me to pray, I know no prayer better than this. And so the Prophet taught him to pray. And the thing that the man was doing wrong is that he was rushing through his prayer, not taking the time to really think and focus about Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. So please try to focus on your salat. One of the ways to help you focus on your salat, believe it or not, is the more surahs that you learn and understand what you're saying, why you're saying them, that will help you to focus. Ya ayyuhalladhina amanu taqu la la taqrabu salaa wa antum suqara hatta ta'lamu ma taqulun O you who believe uh, do not approach prayer while you are intoxicated until you understand what you're saying So many of us are not intox intoxicated but yet we don't understand what we're saying So when we memorize Quran for some of us is like what someone would call, if you don't understand the words you're using, nonsensical words. It's not nonsensical at all. No, it's the words of Allah. Even if you didn't understand them, there's blessings. But better if you understood what you were reciting in the Quran and focus on the words that you're saying in the Salat. So, um, in my opinion, I found that learning the ayats of the Quran and what they mean help us to focus, inshallah.